just want to say a massive thank you that my first video that I uploaded had a very um, positive reaction to it. I was panicking and Yeah, I was panicking because obviously I wasn't sure how people were going to react. I shouldn't really worry, should I? Um, yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all the positiveness that I received. It is a confident booster. So, and um, someone else asked how I did these ones let me get it for you how I did these ones it's a bit dirty but with the um, chameleon powder and they really liked it but they want it in the heart um, the little bubbles there so hopefully these are the um, crushed velvet technique I think they're called and Julie cuts um, she does amazing videos on these ones you should go and check that out and yeah so I thought I'll attempt to do that with the heart mold, which is a bit smaller than these ones. They are so pretty. I don't know if you can see it goes into like the greeny and then the blue. I used the nail powders, nail chameleon powders for them. And then I've, I've, I've got these, but unfortunately I can't tell you what colour they are. It came with nothing on there, but I will add a link to it. And these ones, these are the nail ones. I stole them from my daughter's wardrobe. So yeah, don't, don't, don't let her know that. I'll put it back. I get her a new set. But I think she bought that from Amazon. Both of them was from Amazon, but these one have to wait. So I'm going. There's eight of them there. It comes in eight. So I'm going to try out and see which colors which. And yeah, hope for the best, guys. Hope for the best. So I mixed up the resin. I'm using today uh, Vista Cascade, is that how you say it? I found it very, I, I, I like them. I mixed up uh, Vista resin uh, by weight, that's 100 grams to 45 grams. And I've been mixing it for a while, hopefully it's all good um and someone asked me about the bubbles too well i don't really put them in the bath um, I, I normally put them in i don't put them in anything i just torch and i don't like this container because this container tend to um get the get the process starting very quick um, so yeah, so that's about it and I'm going to go and mix some more and pour it in the mold and I will be right back. I'll see you in a bit. Hey guys, it's been a bit, it's been about, oh, let me put this forward. 
is about um i left it for about 10 minutes 10 to 15 minutes hopefully this is ready to i normally the other one i did i normally um i've done it straight away um, i don't know i thought let me wait for a bit until all the um Or the bubbles goes away. But with resin, you know, there's always bubbles. So I'm going to start doing these. So I cut them into little, little squares. I'm going to put it over like that. And scrunch it up. Maybe this one's not going to work. Oh no, this is not gonna work, guys. It's not thin enough. Let me take back the resin out. Right, I'll be right back. Ay, ay, ay. Right, guys, I'm back. I've done one here. I uh, just wanted to make sure that it works, but it looks okay. Right, the bubbles. The best way you will get bubbles in there because you're putting something on top, so and then you're squeezing it to get that little effect. And you can't torch it, obviously. So what I tend to do, I torch the tip of the um, the needle. Try not to burn your hands while you're doing. And then poke it in. Hot needles works to get rid of bubble because it was pierced through it's best to have the thin ones you know i had so many here but i can't find any of them anyway that's okay so i'm going to go ahead and do the rest in silence I can't see any bubbles in there, but you got to make sure you lift the sides because they tend to come over. Can you see? So make sure you, you can always clean that up later before you put the um uh, the colors in. Not the colors, the pigment. So that's what I do. Heat the gun. Heat the gun. Take the pin and pop it in, and it will pop the bubbles. Right, first one's done. Eight to go. So I'm gonna quickly do these. Okay, let me make sure that it doesn't fall on the other resin, other mold. Because I had that problem before. Trust me, it wasn't very really nice. Um, as you may notice, I'm not using my gloves for this. Because I find it with the gloves, it gets in your way. Because you've got to squeeze that in. And it's really hard when you're squeezing it in and then... Is getting everywhere and then I find the gloves very tricky for me to do that make sure that it's not all spill on the side take your time don't rush it don't rush 
rush it. Because if you rush it, it will be kind of put that over there. So if you rush it, guys, you're not going to get the best effect. It is tedious, but it's worth it. It will look so pretty once it's um once it's done. This is I think this is a hard part. Need trying to um get them in the way you way you want it. This is a hard part. I can't see no bubbles. Yes, I can. I lied right there. Now I can't find the other pin. Get them little um you know the um is it bobby pins? The little color ones. So yeah. Oh, my daughter's up. Uh, let me shut that door, otherwise you can hear. You can hear her talk. Teenagers, eh? Well, she's not even a teenager. She's what? She's she's in her twenties. Yeah, she's in her twenties. She's enjoying life right now. Let her enjoy it. I also find useful to use a sharp like this to get that. Make sure that you don't have the last one I made. I think I got a bit excited so I start doing all sorts of things and then when you try to get rid of get out the um cling film oh this cling film is a normal kitchen cling film that you can find in your kitchen so I just cut it into p um to the size and then it works wonders I was going to use something else, but because they were too thick, these ones, can you see, it's a bit thick, so when you push it, it's not, it's not doing what I wanted to do, so I went and got these ones instead. Now. trick is to pull, pull the cling film from the edge in, oh that's going in, but never mind, and then once you've done that, once you get that rhythm going, you will know how to do it. I did say I was going to do the rest of it in silence, didn't I? Yep. Can't keep my mouth shut. See, I tend to talk more when I'm... Ah! Why? I tend to talk more when I'm nervous. And I'll waffle. Well, that's what my, my children says to me. Mum, stop. I'm like, I'm nervous. When I start waffling, my family knows I'm nervous. So, yeah, so I'm sorry. You, you'll get to know me eventually. You'll be like, oh no, that's crazy angel again. Yep. 
Yep, yep. So I hope you saw what I've done. Should I do one more before I speed up? I didn't have much resin in there. Ooh, that's good. I like that. You see that, guys? It just went straight in. Maybe that's what I need to do. The less resin next time. I need to clean this up. I'll clean it up later. Oh, I like it. I like it. I like it. I like this one. That one wasn't bad, was it? Right. Bubbles. Bubbles, bubbles, bubbles. Let's see one there. Okay, it didn't work. You could get them in eBay in different colors. That's where I got mine from. And a couple of my friends asked me. I ordered some for them. It is on their way. There is a tiny, tiny bubble. Doesn't want to go anywhere. I hope you can't see my grey hair. Let's stuck to that pot. Are you happy? Am I happy? I'm happy, but I can't get rid of that. Bubbles. Ah, oh, these ones are hard to get. I can't even see. Oh, there you are. There you are. It wasn't hot enough. That's why. Okay, I'm going to leave that like that. I'm going to make a mess of the, this one. Because I need my baby wipe, baby wipes. Wipe that off. Because it's overflow, we don't want. I don't want no overflows. <laughs> you know what? I am so fascinated. I keep on telling, I think, I think in every video I probably will mention this, but these white baby wipes, oh my God. What's in them? I need to find out. They clean everything. Okay, so eight done. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna fast forward the rest of it. So, are you guys okay on these ones? If not, then always you can go back and watch what I've done. So, yeah, back in a tick. Hey, 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 done all of them. Now, I'm gonna leave it for about 12 hours. And then um, I come back to do the powders, do the powder. Yep, so I'll see you guys soon. Morning, guys.
So I'm going to take out the thing. Hopefully it works. Because this one I tried to do got stuck in it so I need to figure out how to do take the um, plastic out so I'm going to show you how to do it hopefully it goes okay yay, yay, yay. Um, yeah <clears throat> so I'm just going to peel it off With the coasters, this process was easy. It came off quite easily. But with the hearts, I'm finding it a bit difficult. So I'm going to just do it very gently. Making sure that you don't lift the mold up. If that makes sense. Let me go and get my tool. I use these clippers, you know them nail clippers, the um what they called it. I use it when you do the nails. So I used um I kinda use them to cut the oh look down down over there. So that's why I use, basically you can use anything you want really. And then you just peel it off. Oh, don't like this, so clingy. Clingy. <laughs> so I'm just going to do that. Don't worry about the rough edges at the moment because once you put the black back in on and you let it to cure, it will be, um, you could then cut it off and trim it and things like that. So don't worry too much about sides most of the time it will cover it up let me cut that there Make sure when you're cutting it, don't cut your molds. Cutting the side. Because um, I did that with a couple of them. Completely ruined the mold. Because I was too excited, too impatient to do, do, do it. Peel these off because it's annoying me. So, yeah, don't. So, I tend to use these tools to take the edges off and peel it off. Once you get the rhythm going, it's quite easy. It's a very tedious. Oh look, I've got a bubble right there. Never mind.
take as much time as you could possibly can because um it's not a quick thing because you, you waited all this long and you don't want to go and ruin it you know that I put something on top and this one went like this so you can see that little dip there so hopefully it wouldn't matter when I do the thing there you go I'm going to go and do the, these ones, the rest of it. Oh, let's talk to the other bit. Is Like I said, guys, you got to be very patient when you're doing this process. Take your time. Don't rush it. When he clings on to you, don't like that feeling. do this one to show you and then what I do is I fast forward it the process and then um, please if you have any questions feel free to comment or ask I'll be happy to help if I don't answer it back, don't think that I'm ignoring you. I will get back to everyone. Oh, because it's so clear it's really hard to see if you're taking the films off or not these tools are very handy because you could get to the um, edges better than the scissors can Just tap myself. Never mind. So, yeah, guys, so make sure that you take your time in the process. Don't rush it. Otherwise, you won't, you will ruin what you guys done so far. So, I hope that you saw. Do you want me to do one more? And then... Do one more. 
is nice out there today. Seems nice, sun's out. It was really nice and warm yesterday. So, So you can see you don't really need to put any pressure on. It just comes up, it just comes out. You just have to be it's a very fiddly process, I should say. See it will, it will just comes out. It's gone look. It goes all static. Okay, guys, and what I'm going to do, I'm going to fast forward the rest of it, so you don't have to sit there and watch me do this. It's quite boring. So, once I've done it, I will rejoin you. Hopefully, I didn't go off focus. I'll be right back. Hey, back again. I've got, got all the... um to film things out I'll put some of the um, things on there in the video so you can you can obviously see how I've done it you just have to be very patient with it guys it's a very tedious process but it's fun it is fun 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 I like making these. Hopefully, it turns out nice. You could always go back and trim the edges after once you put the black in. Right. It was uh, when you when you peel in. Obviously, you crunch it up so um, all the um, the film will get into the cracks. So I tend to use these tools and that one uh, so I tend to use all three of them so I just go around looking because when you don't make sure they don't scratch it just ever so gently you go around and doing that and you can see if you got any left mist any um, film mist and you can see it and then you can always go back and tweeze it out like this one, look. See? You can always go back and tweeze it out or you could cut it off. I found that easy with these ones. So get, if you've got them in the house, use them any old tweezers will do fine um done them like i said i had these i bought them from amazon but it came in a bottle like this so i don't know what color is what but i will put a link in it because it, they do have the description on there so I think I'm just going to try them out and see what color is what. And go and hopefully we can figure out which color is which. But because we only got eight of them in there and I've got nine hearts, I'm going to use one of them 
Put this one. This is a nail art. Uh, chameleon. And I think it's blue and purple. Or blue and... I think blue and purple or blue and grey. Or purple and... Gr not grey. Purple and... I can't remember what that one is. But I will get the name of it. But it says 08. So when I put the link on... You guys could see that one. Um, gonna use normal brush. You could use any brush you want. I'm gonna be using these ones and not this one. This one is not. Or you can use them eyeshadow brushes. these ones so let me do some of them in with that brush if I can I'm going to go ahead and show you how I do it so basically you don't need that much you just need a tiny tiny amount Just brush it like you would like a paint, really. Don't use too much simply because it's a powder. So when you put the resin, the black background in, what tend to happen is that it comes floats up and you get at the back you will get something like this oh that's purple guys sorry my thing look that's purple let me see <gasps> oh i hope it comes off yep oh, it's everywhere so that's what happens. So what I'm going to do now. You can still got a little bit of plastic stuck in there. Let me get that up. <coughs> Make sure that you put it in. Brush it in into the little... What they called valleys they look like hills and mountains and valleys in it so into them little cracks Oh, oh no. So that's, I take that purple then. Purple shimmer. Why do I keep on saying shimmer? Chameleon powders. I don't know what is. I'm 
we're gonna do this one maybe one more and then I'll go ahead and um fast forward it don't really need that much oh am i going focus out to focus again sorry guys i tend to go into my own world when i'm doing these things i tend to forget stuff they do say it's therapeutic what i tend to do is um once I've done it, I just blow them, brush them off like this, just outside. I don't know if it's, if these ones are better than the other ones because the um, coasters I made are made made with these. If this doesn't work, then I do have more coming. So it looks like it's purple. Look, I don't know if you can see there on the side. Let's put some on the side so you can see that it's purple. And a nice shim um, chameleon. Oh, actually, it's kind of purple and green. But we'll see. We'll see how it turns out. So it's that, that one. And I'm going to show you this one. Make sure you wipe your brush. Because I only got... One brush. Let me do. Can you see that, guys? That's a difference, isn't it? Can you see that? It's really hard to tell because um because the um, bottom is clear. Oh look, see? Still got some coming out. I 
Tell me I got all them, but I didn't. Obviously, I didn't. You gotta really press your button, button, your brush. Sorry guys, I was recording and then I realised it wasn't recording anymore. So I had to um put my other phone on there. Didn't realise my battery was going on that one. So sorry. Well, I'm back again. Ah where you go? As I was saying, just make sure that you get all them hills and valleys, especially the valleys. Just brush it in. Get your brush in there between them and brush it in. I'm going to write. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I'm going to put the eight on here so I know which one. That's nine. Let's put that over there. Um, oh look. That's seven. Put that over there. Seven, eight, nine is done. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go and do these ones. And then I'll fast forward it so you don't have to sit there and watch me do that. Be right back. I'm back. Mixing some. I'm using um, Vista Cas Cascade resin. Mixed it one, not one to one, two to one volume. And I, I'm now used um, resin, resin eight black pigment paste. I'm gonna go back to work and then I forgot to wear my gloves. Um, yeah, these ones, someone asked me. So these ones I use and yeah, they're very good. I like them. I had no issues with them so far anyway. But um, the latest batch I had it seems to have a little bit of a bubble problem, but that's probably me. The the, I need to keep this warm, um, this room warm. So I'm going to go ahead and pour this in. Hopefully it works. Fingers crossed. Oh, no, no, no. We don't want to do that, do we? No, we don't. That's got blue tint. You can see the um, powder coming. Just going to put a little bit at a time. Because I don't want to overflow the mold. I think I'm going to have a problem with that one. But the rest should be okay. Oh, a bit too much. Oh. 
Oh, wow, the colors at the back. Look, it's coming through. It looks pretty. looks pretty I'm gonna leave it wait for a bit um, well that's it guys you can see that let me take it down a little bit down 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 so you can see that and I'm gonna leave it to kill about 25 25 hours 24 hours and I'll come back and see how it turns out. I might do this again. But yeah. But I'm loving the black um back of it. That looks so cool. Yep, so see you guys soon. Bye. Hey guys. I'm back again to demo these beauties. Yeah, let's do this soon. So here goes. Just looks a bit pink at the back. Don't know what it's gonna look like. At the front, you ready? Are you ready? You sure? Oh, wow. Look at that, guys. That looks really pretty. I can't see any shimmer, but not shimmer like that. It's the effect that I was looking for. I'm going to put it down like this for now. So that's the pink one. Oh, you can't see it so dark. That's the pink. I'll get a better picture tomorrow. Satisfying to demold. It's like a bluey color. Oh, look at that. I do have some bubbles in there, but oh, where are you going? Look. So nice, I got black. Maybe that black got warm. I wonder. This is the one I used nail art. Oh, you can see that, look. The goldy green. Ah, oh, I see. I'll be using the nail one from now on. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's so gorgeous. The reason I'm putting it in there, I was a bit impatient because I was so excited to see how it comes. I will definitely be doing these again. Oh my god, look at that. It's like a pinky brown. Can you see? Pinky brown. Pinky, pinky, pinky. He's got like a... Oof. Come out, come out. Please don't get stuck to me. Oh, there we go. Oh, I put the thumb print on there. It's like a, a green. Oh, I am loving it, guys. Sorry, you can't see properly, but.
Yeah, loving it. I'm going to leave that because that's overflowed on me. Again, it's like a bluey color, like this one, but a bit brighter. Oh, oh my. I love it. What do you guys think? You like it? Again, it was like a purpley color, like that one. Ooh, a lot of focus. Do it this way so you can see it. Oh my god. Look at that. Look at that other bubbles. I like them. It looks like a pearl. Early color. And this is the one that decided, yeah, I'm not going to behave. Oh my god. These are gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. What do you think? purple one came from here not sure in what order it came I think these one this one came here I'm gonna put it here uh, yeah I'm loving it definitely came from there it came from here one from here and this one. Oh, I'm gonna take it down. I'm so happy it turned out perfectly. Let me take it down, guys, so you can see. Look, it's like a green. Oh, my god. So this one is a nail art. I'll be using that one more often. Because it's got that green and gold in there. Oh my god, look at my skin. Oh, we're not looking at that. Uh, look at that. So what do you guys think? Thumbs up or thumbs down? I've got more powders. Let me put you back. These are these ones. I've got six of them, so I'll probably use that one next time I make them and see what happens. Um, yeah. Thanks, guys. So yeah, do tell me how it, how it is. I get some better picture, and I'll put it up very soon. Yep. Thank you. Have a lovely evening and I'll see you tomorrow. Well, I'll see you not tomorrow. I'll see you on the next video. Don't even know what I'm saying. Bye. Stay safe.